The force pad in your HP EliteBook Folio 1040 behaves just like a standard touchpad, but with the added benefit of sensing pressure on the touch area. This enhancement has made it possible for us to include some additional features. For example, even though there are no physical buttons, the force pad senses a click when you press on it. You can click anywhere on the force pad with one or two fingers. When you do, you'll hear a click sound through system audio that can be adjusted in the volume mixer. You can adjust the pressure required for a click in the control panel. Just like on traditional touchpads, you can use two fingers to drag items. Select the item by pressing down with one finger, then use another finger to drag the item around. With the force pad, you can do the same thing, but with only one finger, and you don't need to continue to apply pressure while dragging. Simply select an object with a click and begin dragging. Once the drag is initiated, only a light amount of pressure is required to continue dragging. In the past, right clicks have been a single finger task, and they still are. Just apply pressure with a single finger in the lower right corner of the force pad. You can now also access the right click menu by applying pressure with two fingers anywhere on the force pad. Zooming has never been easier. Zoom in and out as you normally would by pinching your fingers. Once your fingers are fully extended or pinched, simply hold them in place and apply pressure to the force pad to continue zooming. Vary the pressure to increase or decrease zoom speed. Scrolling has improved as well. As usual, initiate scrolling by swiping two fingers on the touchpad. Then, instead of lifting your fingers at the end of the swipe, just hold your fingers down to continue scrolling. Vary the pressure to increase or decrease scroll speed. The rate of scrolling and zooming and more can also be adjusted in the force pad settings window. You can access these controls by clicking on the tray icon in the bottom right corner of your screen and selecting the force pad settings option from the menu.